First thing in the morning, I like to go on YouTube and turn on my fall music. Then I'll go over here because nobody's up yet. I get up at 4 30. I didn't go to bed last night till about ugh, uh, probably midnight, which is not good because we had a late game. So I'm getting a late start. I got my new coffee cup from Dollar General. Sorry if this is blurry. It's dark in here. I use, oh, I'll show you what coffee I use. You guys need to see that. The coffee, my favorite, 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 favorite coffee ever is Berry House coffee. This is by far my favorite, and this is my favorite flavor, Ultimate Hazelnut. So, big time fan of them. Been drinking them for the last, what, year and a half? Something like that. It's amazing. Um, I do have these I want to try out too soon. Irish cream. I've got this new syrup, brown sugar cinnamon, blah, blah, blah. brown sugar cinnamon swirl sauce, caramel apple pie sauce, and then I've got the limited edition pumpkin pie sauce. This is from Kaya which I'll go ahead and pop a code up like um, for you guys because I love Kaya. Look how obsessed I am with Kaya. I found them from my friend um, like a couple of years ago. So like, look at all this. It's so dark in here. Sorry if you can't see that. Look at all these syrups. And then I've got Miss Mary's uh, stuff too. It's really, really good. It's sugar free. Okay, it's not focusing today. It is the weirdest thing. So, I'm trying to focus it. It's not focusing. Anyway, there's the syrups. So many of them. So good. So, I'm going to go put some creamer in my coffee. So, I just... Oh, sorry. I used just the Aldi stuff. My favorite coffee creamer. Sorry, it's so dark in here. But I don't like the light that we have because it flickers. So, um, my favorite. And this has, what... 15 calories, does it? I use sugar free though, you guys know. If you've been here a while, you know that's what I use. And I'll just put some cream in there. I don't really want anything else. I like to fancy up my coffees in the afternoon when I have like a latte. But to start my morning this early, uh, I'll also fill up my water here shortly. I have this bottle, so that's what I fill up. And I try to get my water in, but obviously, coffee, my devotional, and some autumn music are like my favorite way to start the day. So what I'll do is I'll pull up my Bible app and I'll read my Bible um, devotionals. I also have a book called Jesus Calling. Um, I can, I'll show it to you in a little bit because I left it downstairs when I was working. Um, but usually that's how I start my day. I drink my coffee. I listen to this music because no one's up. It's like 4.30. And then I do my devotional before I start my workout, so. Okay, so it's time to do my workout. So I'm gonna get my bulk supplements. That's my BCAA, you can't really see that. I usually do this with my protein shake in a bit, the collagen, just because of the flavor. Then I will get some of this. This is that Miss Mary sugar-free syrup water flavor just because it's pretty bland. Then, lately, so my friend Regina sells, um, <clears throat> partners, actually works with Ravenly. Can you see that? Ravenly brand? I really like that. I just had caffeine, so I don't need it right now. But I've been drinking their, like, different products. It helps with digestion, it helps with, like, brain fog, all kinds of stuff. I'm really curious about it, because it made me feel, like, so much better when I took that, so. I am really going to dive into looking into that because I'm thinking about um, not like partnering with them, like they don't do that kind of stuff, but like becoming a affiliate or even like purchasing their products and kind of doing that sort of thing because I'm really interested in like overall wellness and feeling better and stuff because face it, no one gets any younger. So I've got my vitamins. I've been taking these B B12s. Um, I liked my drops I had, but I'm out of them. So, I like to 
some, have you guys taken ashwagandha? So Ryan got this, Ryan's been taking it and it kind of helps you mellow out. I might take that today, but I don't want to take it on an empty stomach. So I'll wait a little bit. But like just to start my morning, um, I like to get my BCAAs, take those just because um, I'm going to work out. Nothing fancy. I could use a shaker bottle, but I don't like, I know I'm probably unpopular opinion, I don't like super cold drinks. Um, I like my water to be normal, like not hot, just room temperature. So all you need in this is another bulk supplement. Um, I thought I was an affiliate, but I can't get a hold of them. So this bag will last forever because a lot of stuff is pre-mixed with all that other kind of junk. So you get like 30 servings in it. This thing, look at this bag. Look how big that bag is. This will last forever. So I didn't have all the extra crap in it. Sorry, I keep moving the camera. So I'm just going to mix my BCAAs and instead of buying all that fancy stuff that everybody buys, because you know I used to get it too, not gonna lie. And then I'm gonna put some of Miss Mary's mix in there. Which is sugar free. They have, I have several of these bottles. This one's the Pina Colada because I love the tropical taste. So that is not really food, but this is what I'm having. All right, breakfast time, you guys. I am not a breakfast person, not a single bit. So I will a lot of times I'll make a protein shake. I won't even like bother with blending it, but I like the way it tastes better. So I'm actually going to get some ice real quick. I never know how much to put in there. So I've got some ice. I am going to go ahead and put some liquid in, which would be the almond milk. Um, let's see, you can weigh it. I don't really care about weighing that. I'm just putting milk in to give it some consistency. I'm going to use my Earth Chimp. This is Martha. My Earth Chimp protein powder. Love this stuff. It's got probiotics in it. It is the best. It um it is so good. Like, I don't have enough words to say about this. Um, it's got probiotics. It's got lots of protein in it. It's organic. It's, um, you can get this off of, there's no added sugars either, by the way. You can get this off of Amazon or you can get off their website. So, and if I have a code, I'll give you a code because I love it. I buy it. It's good. I try to hide it because the kids, I feel like the boys will inhale this. Like, they will literally, if I buy other protein, I buy this, they will they will take this look how the packaging is too super cute so also bulk supplements look at this giant bag i've already had my bcaa's i want to put more in uh branch chain amino acids i usually do that with my workout in the morning um so i've already had that gavin had that out so i've got collagen huge bag like i'm telling you you can save so much money i wish they would give me a code to give you guys i've been buying bulk supplements for years on and off Depends on if I'm on my game with like working out the right way. Um, but like so much cheaper, so much cheaper than anywhere else. So um, you can buy like huge, you don't need all the frills. Like all the packaging is what like all these people, like you know, the marketing of like things with like, and I do love Alani, but like the little containers, you could buy with something like this for the price of that. I mean, make your money stretch don't get caught up in the gimmicky ads and the beautiful aesthetically pleasing um like product because it doesn't matter i'm going to put like a few tablespoons of pumpkin actually let's do that many it's going to be like a chocolate pumpkin protein shake and i've never done it so <laughs> you guys are sharing this with me i'm thinking hmm should i should not i might add some peanut butter Let's get some, but I don't want to add like, I would rather eat peanut butter than like ever add, sorry, I would rather eat peanut butter, like if you're going to focus on calories, I would rather eat peanut butter than put it in a shake and have the flavor. So with that in mind, I have the PB Fit. I'm sure you have heard of it. I've tried to make the PB Fit with like a apple slices and water and stuff and it's all right, but it's very, like the texture kind of sucks. But if you blend it into things, it has protein in it and takes the place. So it's like basically peanut powder. Like, so it doesn't have all the excess fat and stuff in it. And it tastes good. It just gives that like flavor without, I mean, cause it's made for peanuts, but it doesn't have the extra, you know what I mean? 
I cannot find the lid. I'm sorry, I'm losing my mind. So this is, um, the noise on this is so loud. This is that Ninja Blender. I got it a couple years ago on special because like, I've had my other one, which is just a food processor since we first got married almost, yeah, 20 years ago. So I got to use this one. Actually, not 20. Is it 20? Yes, yeah, 20. Okay, so here we go. I'm going to blend this. I'm going to turn this off because it's loud. Like, listen, listen to how loud. Someone's going to complain if I do this. So it's blending. It's pretty good. That is pretty good. Mm. I think it needs some sort of like vanilla mixture to it, but it's smooth. The consistency is smooth and creamy. I like that. Like I've never added pumpkin to one of those. I love pumpkin though, but my favorite thing is to roast a pumpkin in the oven. Like when the kids don't use them anymore before they rot and like they, they, cause they like to paint the pumpkins. A lot of times we'll paint them. So that way we don't like carve all that and it rots all over the porch and it's just gross. Um, but they do it so early. They want to do it like as soon as Aldi's has them and I'm like, which they have them now and I'm like, oh my gosh, you're going to like, they're going to be a disgusting mess all over the porch with like bugs and ugh, really, really spooky pumpkins because they're gross. But anyway, um, I like to take the pumpkins. If they paint the pumpkins, I like to take the pumpkins like the bake, like you can bake them in the oven and then you can scoop out the flesh and you can freeze it. And I like to bake with it. I, um, I think you guys I think what I want to do, I'm debating it. I think I've got some ground turkey in the fridge. I'm going to use the rest of this and make some pumpkin chili because it's cozy, it's comforting, it's loaded with protein. It's so delicious and um, I haven't made it in a really long time because it hasn't felt fallish. Well, it's been 100 degrees all the time. But today it is actually 53 degrees out this morning in Kentucky. So I'm sure it's going to get like to 80s later. But it felt like fall and it made me want to make pumpkin chili. So we might do that. That might be what we make for dinner which then I'll eat for lunch tomorrow. Um, so that is my breakfast. I don't do much. I have to take my medicine. I take my vitamin, which is just generic Walmart, and I've got my protein shake. Because like I said, I'm not a big breakfast person. If I, like Ryan and my family, they love like the meats. They love like the, the more like biscuits and gravy, the carnivore meals, stuff. I don't. I like the sweets. I like pancakes and French toast, that kind of stuff. Cinnamon rolls, like all the stuff that is not good at all for you. I love that. So um, I don't really, I've never really loved breakfast. I do like to eat like oatmeal uh, or Greek yogurt and stuff like that. But this is perfect for me. I've also made myself another coffee. I didn't show that on camera. I already made myself another coffee because like I said, we got home last night at woof midnight or not midnight we go we i went through mcdonald's shame shamefully i went through mcdonald's at like 10 30 last night because we got home so late and so normally i'm in bed at that point 10 30. <sighs> lately i've been in bed at like 11 30 because i've been working because i have a small business downstairs so i've been working a lot and not getting to bed till 11 30 and then getting up at 4 30 and i don't i i don't ever um suggest that so yes i've been loading up on caffeine but I'm going to fill my water up, you guys. Also, I have, here's my water jug. I'm trying to try to be a good girl today because we need water. I, I can fill this up with caffeine today. Um, and then look how cute this is. Water drop. I, I had like forever the Brita filter water in the fridge. And then we have a filter, but it moves literally, I could watch paint dry faster. Um, the way the water comes out and the filters are so expensive for the fridge. So I just bought this a while back on Amazon for like 20 some dollars, but I had rewards, so I got it free. Um, but I just fill up my water, you know, um, normally I would drink my liquid IV. Um, if I have the clip, I'll insert it because that was something I was filming one day, but then I like ran out of time to finish filming because of my life. So I'll try to insert that clip so I can show you because Generally, I will drink one of those. I love liquid IV. Love it. Like the sugar-free kind. Um, but I'm out of it. So anyway, and I have a discount code for you guys on that. And I only give you guys that because, well, because it saves you money. Like, you know, this channel is all about saving money. So um, that is what my life is set on, is saving money. So um, I do have a code. And I'll have to look it up because I haven't used it in a while. But, um, like when it's sports time and stuff, we use it, we use that a lot. So I highly recommend it, especially the new cotton 
candy flavor, the kids went nuts over that. And the bomb pop flavor, they went crazy. Like, they loved it. They requested me to buy it. So, anyway, I will share my lunch in a bit. What's up at Sam's Club? I love my um, built bars, but I don't have any more. I ate them too fast. <laughs> so, I picked these up. I really like these Fit Crunch bars. And then they've got protein in them and low sugar and stuff. So, I'll eat this and probably make another cup of coffee and get my day going. I'll also get my water because I drink water all day long and then fruit in between here too. I I love fruit. I ate a lot of fruit, ate a lot of vegetables. So I'll get this out. So I've got like chocolate chip cookie dough and I've also got peanut butter. And then I like the peanut butter jelly ones they have but they didn't have these in this box at Sam's. Another cup of Mary House coffee. A fit crunch bar and I will take my multivitamin and then I will also take my medicine. Okay, so here is dinner. I put a roast from Sam's in the crock pot, potatoes I just chopped up that I had on hand, and carrots. I keep them stored in a mason jar in the fridge with water because it stays well for a long time. I was going to use a brown gravy mix and one Italian seasoning and one ranch. I didn't have it. I was also going to put beef broth. So I was supposed to use brown gravy, but I'm just going to use two Italians just to give it flavor. And then I'm going to cook this on low for, and I put one and a half cups of water in here. I'll cook this on low for about probably eight hours today. Um, it can cook all day long. Just put that simmer together. It'll be really good. I probably should have put that on the roast. But anyway, I have a busy day, so I like when I can turn on the crock pot and let it cook. And it smells so good. So we'll cook it on low. Like I said, for eight hours. A big beautiful roast is underneath there. Like Sam's Club has the prettiest roasts, but this will be protein packed vegetables all that and then i'll probably serve some rolls with it or something um i probably won't eat them but i'll serve it for them and that will be our dinner later so we'll come back later okay sorry for the halloween lights flashing oh my gosh my lights so to the dollar general i'm gonna just share my quick haul with you got some generic dawn this didn't have much lotion there, so I picked this up because my skin is killing me lately. So I didn't know I was going to Dollar Tree. I would have just gotten it there, but I got this. These trash bags. I don't need tropical scent ones, but I picked it up. I wanted the coconut Lysol wipes. I really didn't need Lysol wipes, but I use paper towels and waste them all the time to wipe off. I wipe off my bathrooms every day and my kitchen every single day. Every single morning. It's part of my routine at like 4.30 in the morning, and that's what I do. I know it's crazy, but I do it every day. So I thought I'd get those to save me the hassle, and they smell good, and they were on sale. And then we need some conditioner, and I was gonna order from Sam's, like online, where I had to pay extra for like delivery the other day. So I was like gonna order it, but I didn't. But Emily needed conditioner. So I just picked both of these up, because they were like 5.75, and they're huge. <laughs> so I got those. And then I got this for my group um, on Facebook, which feel free to join. And Emily is the one that like found it and thought it, or I saw it, but I wasn't going to buy it because I didn't need it. I said that she could do like a giveaway and like put a bunch of names in here. Like in every Friday she'd like draw out of it. And then the person she drew out would get like a free like, print or something. So there's that. And then that was $42 for nothing. <laughs> and then over here, this was super cute. Em, em likes to paint things and she knows I love coffee. Guys, I'm sorry about this light. It's terrible. Can't wait. Um, and then Emily wanted these. Hang on, I want to turn the light. Sorry if it's dark, but I can't stand that light. I've got to get it fixed. So Emily got these little things to make something I was with. gonna put them on this stuff. And I got this little pumpkin because it's pink and it could decorate my um, workroom because it's so cute. Then they wanted Cheetos, like, um, These are so good. Oh my gosh, my dogs are going nuts now. <laughs> and then they actually, I was going to buy pumpkin things at the gas station the other day. And to get, like, two of them, it was going to be, like, $4 or something stupid, or $3.50. These are dollars from five for four. I picked those up. I don't know. I was impulsively buying candy. Reese's Pieces. And then Lainey wanted candy corn at the Dollar General, but I knew we were going to Dollar Tree, so I picked that up. I need rubber bands for, like, my prints, because... The tape I'm using is not working. Then Lainey needed a brush, so we just got that real quick. And then I was gonna teach people how they can make budget-friendly decor, budget-friendly 
gifts, just things like for themselves. Like I thought that would be fun. And with where I print like UV, which is like a big sticker printer in a sense, like an overpriced sticker printer, it's huge. I've got like a 24 inch printer and I need to like start sharing that. And I was gonna show people ways they could use it because my prints are inexpensive. Um, but I got that cup, these for like Halloween, this one, that one, and, and a latte one, which I buy those anyway for my, for my coffee stains. I love them. And then I got this for like treats. And then this was Halloween-ish. So I got that. It was like candy corn. Yeah. Um, um, and then I said she could get like a, make like a full cup wrap, which goes on like the whole cup. And it could be like little like skeletons everywhere or like ghosts. Oh yeah, it's super bright. For this. <laughs> so. Um, and then Lady got a toy somewhere. So all of that was $25 $20. oh, yeah. for this. So those are my hauls.